Hi everyone, Robert here with another video. In this video, we're going to have a look at uh, we're going to we're going to look at adding tags and specifically room tags. We're going to uh, add room tags to a view. We're going to duplicate a view with detailing, duplicate a view as dependent, and change the view tags assigned type. So in this drawing, we've got another practice file. Uh, that we've taken from uh, uh, Alice Moss uh, training guide. So we want to activate the ground floor wing, which we are in, and then we want to hover the mouse over different rooms and note that the room elements have been placed in each room. So uh, you can see there, these are actually room spaces. And if I hover over this one, as you can see, I can see the room office 103 okay and I activate the now we want to activate um, annotate ribbon which we already have activated here this is annotate ribbon and then we want to go to select the tag all tool we we'll select tag all okay now we want to select the room tag, which is here, and we'll say, uh, okay. Now, what happened was uh, the room tags are placed in all the rooms. Now, we want to go back into our view, and we want to highlight this view that we have. We want to right click. And we're going to go down to duplicate our view and we're going to duplicate our view it's a straight duplicate okay now you see what happened that view opened up and um, the, the, the duplicated view does not show the room tags because we duplicated just the view now uh, we want to now rename this view that we just opened up we're going to right click We'll select rename and then we want to uh, uh, actually we can do we can select the F2 as well but we want to go we'll do that later you want to rename the ground floor view wing uh, instead of see we'll say no no uh, no detail in here and then we'll select uh, and then we'll press OK so now we select we could we actually have another view along with the other view this view right here now we want to go back into this view now uh, now we want to go back to our ground floor again here now we want to right click actually let's do this now let's click F2 and select this and place oh, I'm on the keyboard uh, yes F2 Oh, didn't work. Well, shoot, I'm on the keyboard, so mine doesn't work. Uh, maybe it's shift. Uh, hold on, let me try this. Shift F2. Doesn't work. But on the keyboard, you can select F2. And you can go right back into the, um, the rename dialog box, but it's not working for me. On a, I'm on a laptop. Maybe on your desktop that would work. So again, we want to go. Um, we want to go back into our uh, ground floor, and we want to right click, and we want to duplicate this view with detailing. So now, duplicate with detailing. Know that the room, the rooms come back with all the tags in it. So um, now we want to rename 
the ground floor admin at the ground floor admin wing, the one we just created. We want to right click and we want to rename this guy. Oops. Rename this one to with detailing. So you get the mess get you get the idea of what's going on here. Then we'll press OK. OK now. Let's go in and let's select one of these room tags. Let's just uh, let's zoom in and let's select one of the room tags. And we'll right click and then we'll select all instances in all instances in visible view. So that selects everything. Now in the drop down menu where it says room tags okay yep here we go in the drop down menu here where it says room tags we can say tag with area and then we'll add the area comes in and the room updates with the areas in. So we can switch back to our original ground floor wing area and note that the room tags that view did not update, update. You see, so let's go back our ground floor. All right. The rooms didn't update and we'll go back to our, our details. It will know uh, details. So that was a, just a quick example of what we can do with room tags as far as our rooms. So we actually created what we did. We we uh, we had this view. We added tags to it. We added tags with detailing, then no detailing, and with detailing we came back and modified our tags by selecting right click select all instances this is what a project and we were able to go in and basically we can add volume oh that's not community computer because of room tags and all right how we did area so thank you for watching this video uh, we really went in depth with our room tags this time so uh, Yes, thank you for watching this video, and if you have any questions, uh, put it in the uh, question area, or if you like it, like it, or uh, if you subscribe, that'll be good, because uh, it helps me out a lot, because I make these videos every day. Thanks again, and bye.